joined now by Dr. Dennis Robinson. He's with the Allergy and Asthma Clinics of Georgia. Dr. Robinson, a lot of people suffering right now, it seems like. Uh, is it early in the year for all the pollen to be coming out? It's earlier each year. Uh, our warming of our climate uh, makes it a little bit earlier each year compared to the 30 years I've been watching that. Well, what can you know? What are you seeing right now from your patients? Uh, we uh, we have a lot of different products we use for that. Uh, but right now, what's irritating most people is tree pollen. We're seeing an influx of flu and even COVID now at the same time. Right. And, 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 you know, the hard part is sometimes our patients have a hard time figuring out, is this a infection or is this a allergy? But say you already have allergies going on and then you throw flu on top or you or strep or uh, COVID, uh, that makes it kind of hard for them to pick up on it early. And, you know, with those viral illnesses, some of them have antiviral therapy that needs to be started within about 48 hours to give them a good benefit from it. So people shouldn't just sit back and say, well, I'll just try to suffer through it. No, uh, if they do that, they almost wait too late for say they do have flu or COVID for us to be able to offer them a therapy that may shorten the course of the illness or prevent a bad problem like a hospitalization. So what's your, uh, what's your advice for people right now as they're going about their daily lives? Yeah, if they have allergies, and we've diagnosed many, many over the years, if they know they're allergic to tree pollen, you really want to go ahead and get on your maintenance preventive medicines early. If you wait till your nose is all stopped up, it is really hard to get those medicated nose sprays in the nose. They'll just run right back out. And so you'll be caught at the mercy of a lot of the symptoms. Is it going to get worse as the spring comes on? That's right. It's only getting worse, and we call it priming, right? So you first get the inflammation going, and then here you just kind of egg it on every day, and it just adds to that increased inflammation. All right, so good advice, Dr. Dennis Robinson. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you, sir.